if you were going to get into raising moths or even butterflies, we have to play by nature's rules, not humans. Stick with me because I'm going to explain why bringing them into your home, raising them up, and releasing them can have devastating effects on the species and ecosystem. If you find a wild moth or butterfly stuck in their cocoon chrysalis, there was probably something genetically wrong and natural selection would have taken place. And this is where we need to respect nature's rules, not humans. But if you wanted to take it home and try to save it, you can just please do not release it back into the wild. Now let's talk about the eggs we order online or that we find in the wild and then we bring them into our homes. We shouldn't release these moths either, and that is because we could be introducing disease and pathogens that they don't have an immunity or resistance to, and we don't want to release that into the wild population either. If you are interested in helping out moths and butterflies and raising them up, start planting native plants around your yard and then just watching the whole cycle take place. Follow for more moth content.